Taurus, how are you? We're doing your tarot reading for the month of March. Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus in Taurus. What deck should I use for you? Why am I being drawn to this deck? You could be thinking, well, why did you put it on the table? I was drawn to it. I think this might be the first time I use it. And I actually have some sticky notes here because the court cards, for example, like the the page, uh, the queen, the king, they have different names. So let's see, Taurus, we have the Eight of Cups. And here the vials are the, uh, the cups. Okay, the Eight of Cups. Okay, there is someone here that has disappeared. <laughs> There's someone here that has disappeared, they left, there's something like that. Okay, the Eight of Cups, the very first card. All right, so this is for those of you that left or somebody, somebody left. Moving on, moved, distanced yourself, someone here, something like that. Okay, this is the Eight of Cups. I feel like for those of you that I'm connecting with, there's someone here that I'm here. You could have left someone because they were drinking too much. I feel like addictions could be a thing. You see these uh, these cans actually, so like beer, there might be like a heavy drinker. I'm also getting that for many of you, you have walked away from a particular lifestyle, for example. Maybe you used to party a whole lot, drink. And uh, well, you're, you're moving towards a better place. Let's see. I feel like there's a drinker here, certainly. Let's see, let's see. Let's see, Taurus, 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 Taurus. My dear bull gang, I love you guys so much. I'm a Taurus, for those of you that don't know. We have the Justice card, okay? There could be a Libra of significance. Justice, I'm hearing that this had to absolutely be done. That's what I'm hearing. This absolutely had to be done. What do we have here? We have the 10 of, actually this is the supervisor. Here the supervisor is the queen. Okay, this is the queen, the queen of cups. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces of significance doesn't have to be. Strong water energy. I'm also getting here that for many of you, temp temptation, okay, tempting could be a thing, but just means, right, that there's an energy here that is trying to pull you back to a place where you once were and that you have moved away from. Somebody like that here, Justice card. I feel like karma is certainly playing a role here, and what I mean by karma is like somebody got somebody got what they deserve or, or, or you know what was meant for them based on the actions decisions that they made okay maybe that sounds nicer karma just has carries a punch right um there might be something about somebody's toe uh, i know weird something about somebody's toe here we have the three of swords okay and we have the wheel of fortune wow I'm hearing somebody was just, I'm hearing the wrong time. Somebody was uh, where they were not supposed to be. I'm hearing at the wrong place, at the wrong time. Guys, for many of you, I feel like there could be like, uh, I feel like, yeah, heavy drinking, partying. I feel like something took place. Uh, yeah, Leo of significance for many of you. I'm hearing being at the wrong place at the wrong time, okay? with this will of fortune so a lot of uh, things that happen unexpectedly let's see let's uh, get uh, let's clarify this some more okay hmm tell me more about this will of fortune and this three of swords a heavy energy guys certainly i'm feeling it in my forehead uh we have saved this memory wow okay yeah, guys, I feel like something took, I'm hearing something took a wrong turn here. There is someone that has moved away, walked away from something that is no longer felt that was not serving them. They certainly, whoever left here, distanced themselves, felt like this was the right thing. For select a few, the law could be involved here in some way. And here with this Queen of Cups, I feel like uh, there's somebody, somebody here left 
still thinking about this, okay, with this Queen of Cups, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces of Significance. I'm here, I'm here wanting to revisit this, this, this place, this time, save the memory. Yeah, I'm hearing uh, making a lasting impression. Here we have chemical plant, negative consequences. Chemical plant, negative consequences. Yeah. I feel like there was something here that was done with this Wheel of Fortune, which did not have good results with the Three of Swords. I feel like somebody could feel backstabbed or just betrayed. Strong disappointment. We have empty pockets, nothing to give. I feel like there's someone uh, that's feeling like um, they couldn't do anything about it. They didn't do anything about it. They couldn't do anything about it. Okay, let's see. Let's see, guys. And I'm feeling very uncomfortable, guys, like right now. Let's see. We have friends and family okay so friends family could certainly play a role here and then it says christianity involved okay friends and family christianity involved i feel like very strong beliefs here family right uh, beliefs that were taught i'm hearing um a way somebody acts guys i'm there's some very toxic 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 energies here guys they're they're making me very sick as a matter of fact um uh after this i want to put uh this deck up just because i have so at least a handful of other readings that I have to do and I have to really preserve my energy and I'm not wanting to tap into this some more. Let's see guys. Um, yeah, friends and family Christianity involved. So, you know, I, again, I feel like for many of you, family could be of significance here. Certain beliefs as well that caused a someone to believe um, something was wrong not right here we have research book yeah so i feel like there's an individual here right um that needs to expand their mind i'm hearing that needs to open themselves up a bit more and i'm hearing and certainly they have learned that from this experience okay however that resonates research yeah i feel like there is uh, there was somebody here that was lacking some awareness some information and um again i feel like things took a turn i certainly feel like whatever is happening now was unforeseen Meaning, right, that the decisions, the actions that somebody took, I'm hearing back then, they did not expect this outcome or they did not expect things to turn out the way that they are now. I feel like there's somebody feeling very regretful here. I'm also hearing guilty. Do you see the way this person has their hands up? Like, okay, fine. Okay, fine. I feel like this could, again, I, I feel like law enforcement could be a thing here. Somebody addictions as well heavy drinking with this eight of cups i just feel like there was somebody that was not in the right state of mind mentally emotionally spiritually i feel like they have learned uh, very big lessons through whatever this is whatever this experience is and i feel like for many of you it took someone removing themselves with the eight of cups and with this justice, I'm, I'm hearing again, I'm hearing karma, right? And what is karma, guys? Don't be scared of karma. Karma it are just lessons, okay? And that's this book for many of you. Lessons, a very big lesson here that is being learned. I feel like a lot of fear, a close-mindedness um, as it pertains to, I'm hearing the crowd that you hang out with, somebody here hangs out with, family, again, just surroundings, the way somebody has been brought up, the company that they have entertained. Um, here with Christianity involved, I feel like it... <clears throat> again, guys, I, I'm, I'm, just, I'm just going to say close-mindedness, okay? Very, very, very close-minded. 
very judgmental as well guys with this crucifix it's just like the energy that i'm getting negative consequences chemical plant yeah guys for a very selective few i feel like advice here could have been taken and uh well it, it was the wrong advice here that is pretty much the situation that we have guys wow low extreme energies here guys which you know to me is um like what i'm feeling guys it feels like your mind it feels like somebody evolving <laughs> guys evolving hurts okay evolving hurts okay the way that i like to see it is like um i like to think about it like this so your brain, you evolving as a person, it means that you're expanding your mind. You're expanding your mind, which means that there's parts of your brain, for example, that have not been active. So like right now I'm getting an image of uh, a light turning on. So again, you know, it's like this room, for example, and you turn on the light. And then right now I'm seeing the light flicker. It's kind of like that, right? It takes some time and then it just turns on. I also like to see it as, uh, for example, like wires in your head and they're very rusty because uh, that part of uh, your brain, for example, has not been used, has not been accessed. And when you expand your mind, you grow, okay? It's, it's like there's electricity running through these rusty wires, right? And that could be painful if you can imagine, okay? That's pretty much what I see going on here. It's someone, it's someone expanding their mind. I feel like they were in a very low place and I feel like karma, okay, the universe here with the justice and the will of fortune has certainly stepped in to teach someone a very, very, very big lesson about the choices, the decisions that they have made. And through this experience, they are growing and they are evolving. I feel like whatever happened here is very fresh still in somebody's mind. Save the memory. Again, it has made a lasting impression nothing to give i feel like this was the type of person that uh could have had um, a strong lack of self-worth again or maybe they found themselves in a place again that that was not that was not good i'm also hearing a person that did not have anything to give because they were i'm hearing they were poor spiritually mentally emotionally right they were poor i'm hearing but they didn't think so okay they thought they were rich i'm hearing they thought they were rich in spirituality, okay, I'm hearing, but they've certainly been taught a lesson here, I'm, I'm hearing, they certainly have, been, and then right now I'm hearing touched by God for, for many of you, which just to me, touched by God is just representative of a person who has a very profound experience, okay, let's see, interesting, Woo. I'm going to keep on using this deck, guys. Let's see, the energy's uh, cleared out a little bit. Let's see, well, what about this? What about this? What about this? I'm feeling very uncomfortable, guys. What about this? What about this? Taurus, what about this? We have the Six of Swords, all right? The Six of Swords. And then it says, first place. Okay, what about this? First place okay the six of swords all right so the six of swords is all about moving away from a very toxic problematic energy that's pretty much what is being done here uh, okay um there's i'm not liking this person's vibe okay just energetically what it is that i'm feeling i honestly guys i feel like there's someone here that thought they were doing the right thing something like that okay and i feel like this person's like yeah i did it first Okay, that's what I'm hearing. Yeah, I did it first. And I'm hearing, and they're not even realizing that they're the toxic ones. Yeah, you know, I did the right thing. I removed myself from here. But dude, uh, thanks for that, right? You removed the toxic energy because you, you, you toxic. It's actually you. So thanks for that, okay? We have the judgment. What am I saying? The judgment reversed. Yeah, somebody made a bad call here, guys. Somebody made a bad decision. Let me tell you, judgment reversed. They didn't use their best judgment. Certainly, they did not. Judgment reversed, guys. Here, first place. I'm hearing th someone thought they were winning. Somebody thought that they were winning. But judgment here reverses. No, you're not. No, you're not. Loser. Okay, let's see. Wow. 
there's this competitiveness here as well guys with this like first place yeah you know and then right now i'm here and i'm going places okay and here is the hangman this could be a pisces of significance yeah uh, again what it is that you should know i feel like okay what it is that you should know there's someone here that made a bad decision made a bad call they certainly did not know it at first but i feel like certainly now they do with this hangman because this hangman says that uh, this person is feeling stuck and the hangman guys this energy is very uncomfortable which is probably why i'm feeling that way right now okay this hangman guys is very uncomfortable the way that i have experienced the hangman the way that i see the hangman is when you're put in a situation, circumstances that you did not ask to be in, but that you can't get out of until you gain a different perspective. Ooh, let me tell you, this hangman, guys, my goodness, this hangman could be worse than the devil. I'm serious, guys. This hangman could be worse than the devil because you're stuck, guys. And we're pretty much, you're, you're being challenged here in a sense to think differently, to gain a higher perspective. And that's the only damn way you're going to get out of the situation that you're in through expanding your mind. Again, guys, I feel like what you need to know is that I feel like there's a particular person here that is stuck, okay? And I'm hearing, and they're not going to be moving until, okay, they gain a different perspective here, which I'm hearing is the only way forward. It certainly is with the hangman, guys. This hangman, excuse my French, is a bitch, guys. Scorpio of significance with this judgment. Okay, that is something that you should know. Let's get one more card. There's someone here all tied up. We have the Ten of Cups. Wow. Okay, the Ten of Cups. And then here we have, yeah, like a group of three people hugging each other yeah with with the and then here we have the magician the magician what is the magician doing here it looks like he's hiding right and there's like he's making a phone call or something the number eight could be of significance with this ten of cups i, I feel like um forgiveness okay do you see these people coming together there's there's this sense of like surrendering 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 and giving in surrendering and giving in it's what i'm getting guys with this magician and this this ten of cups i'm hearing the key i'm seeing this magician as a key which you know this this magician is all about the possibilities it's 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 i'm, I'm seeing it as a key here that's what i keep hearing that's the key I'm hearing that's the place that this hangman needs to get to, right? This individual here. There's this place of surrender, giving in for each and every one of you, right? That surrender is going to be different. Meaning, right, that for, you know, for everyone, for different groups of you, right? This is going to vary what exactly that surrendering is. Here we have Martini, plan a night out. Let's see with this ten of cups there's also this like completion as well with this ten of cups right it, it which to me it seems as though these people especially the one in the middle if you can see they have they they look relieved so for some of you i feel like pride could be of significance here plan a night out let's see plan a night out let's see Taurus what is this it says night armor up and fight armor up and fight plan a night out yeah here with this plan a night out guys I, I feel like there needs to be um, a release here that takes place certainly a release armor up and fight perhaps for many of you this is not giving up maybe that I feel like for many of you that could certainly be the conclusion here that somebody needs to derive to armor up and fight
So for many of you, I feel like whoever this individual is here, whether it's you or somebody else, my dear Taurus, I feel like there's you're feeling very uncomfortable and you could be wondering, well, what is it? What is it? What is it that is it's making me feel this way? What is it that I'm doing wrong? Okay, here with this judgment reverse. What is it? What is it that I need to move away from? What? 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 And, and I feel like this person is trying, right? Could be trying to do that, but still I'm hearing they fell. And it's like, what is it? What is it? What is it that I need to see? Plan a night out and this armor up and fight. Martini could be somebody's favorite drink. That's actually my favorite drink. And yeah, that's an olive. I My favorite drink is, I haven't had one guys in a long time. I can't remember the last time I had I had one. Plan a night out. Yeah, you see that's an olive. So like a dirty martini for some of you. Armor up and fight. Yeah, I feel like there's an individual here that needs to, in a sense, perhaps stand up for themselves. They need to stand up for themselves. They need to be brave. And they need to face perhaps the consequences here of their actions. Armor up and fight. I feel like that makes someone sick some avoidance here certainly i i feel let's see disease some yeah i feel like that makes someone sick and look at this stomach guys that looks like a martini at the very bottom so again i feel like drinking okay guys certain behavioral uh patterns here okay that certainly are getting in the way it says diamond endure the hard times yeah i feel like this yeah, I feel like this person is having a whole lot of trouble, okay? There's a lot of things, feelings, emotions here that this person needs to process, become comfortable with. There's a strong level of uncomfortableness here, guys, where I feel like, yeah, this this person is not, they're feeling uncomfortable in their skin. And again, I feel like it has a lot to do, okay, I was going to say with what it is that they're putting in their body, which is trash. Now, I'm hearing for many of them, this has to do with the company, again, the company that they're surrounding themselves with everything that they're i mean they're like sponges right now this person they're taking a a, a lot of things in and, and they're certainly being called to walk away from a lot of things in their life a lot of them we saw in the beginning so endure the hard times diamond yeah i feel like this person has been through some hard times but look i i feel like it has made them stronger and I'm hearing and more valuable as well as a human being. They're a, they're a better person. And I'm also hearing that, you know, they need to see their, their worth. They need to see their worth and what it is that they have been doing to themselves. No value here, trash. Yeah, again, I, I feel like this person is entertaining people, situations, again, like addictions as well that are not good for them. And then look, guys, here. And a lot of them, I feel like it has to do with their up bringing perhaps they're very closed uh, bigoted i'm also hearing beliefs that they have perhaps religion could have been like a very big thing in their life okay crucifix things that they i'm hearing pull themselves away from just because they're they were told to okay let's see let's see let's see where is this going where is this going, Taurus? Where is this going? What is next? Let's see. What is next, Taurus? What is next? What can you expect to unfold? Let's see. Here we go. We have the tower. The number 16 could be of significance. It's really popping. The tower. Where is this headed? We have the six of cups. Well, look at that. I'm hearing, uh-oh. Dun, 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 dun. That's a person back there. You see that? I mean, sorry to interrupt. <laughs> sorry to interrupt. That's what I'm hearing, guys. Sorry to interrupt. Third uh, party energy for some of you. Okay, and then we have the Ace of Swords. Aha! That's what I'm hearing. Aha! Somebody is having a breakthrough. I feel like that's that hang person. There's a breakthrough that is had here, certainly, guys. Oh, I see what's been going wrong. And guys, it doesn't happen overnight. We all learn through experience, guys. We all learn through experience. And experiences, you know, certainly take a while <laughs> to take effect. 
so yeah the the ace of swords guys i see the ace of swords as a new way of thinking uh, an epiphany clarity like ooh, a brand new idea still to me i'm seeing it as that higher perspective that uh, that hangman is supposed to um get to and with this tower i feel like it's going to make such a huge dramatic impact <clears throat> We have the world card. You see, I see the world card, guys. You see, you see this card? Doesn't that look like a nice view? You could say this is the person at the very top of a skyscraper and they're looking at, at the city from way up there. We have the executive of cups here, vials. Look at this, look at this dude here, goodness. That's the king of cups, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces of significance. Yeah, I'm hearing this person has their eye I mean, they're focused. Look at this person. This person is, wow. They're focused. Look at them. Wow. But they're calm, right? They're like, okay, I'm about, I'm about to do this. Let me just, uh, let me sip on my coffee first. <laughs> yeah, yeah. They're very, very focused here. Okay, and then right now it's like they're watching this this woman here. They're watching this woman from the, they're watching this woman. So if you could think about it like this, this woman is at the edge, right, of a skyscraper at the very top. And this person, let's just say that at the very top of this skyscraper, there is a restaurant. And this person's in there and they're watching. I mean, right now I'm hearing through the looking glass, okay. the world card aquarius of significance yeah guys well so yeah i'm seeing this as a brand new perspective there could be a leo of significance the number eight could be of significance as well and right at the bottom guys and remember earlier i said maybe pride could you know pride here i felt it and we could see that with this lion Maybe there's a Leo here of significance. Uh, and here we have the Five of Cups. And then you notice that hit there? Let me show you guys. Can you guys see? It says you lose. You lose. Okay, I, I don't, my camera. Okay, yeah. It says you lose. You lose. And then here it says continue. You lose, continue. Yeah, guys, so pretty much what we have here is somebody has to accept some sort of failure. And well, I'm hearing that they have to accept failure. I'm hearing, yeah, buddy, grow up. It happens. I'm hearing to the best of us, you fuck up sometimes. I feel like, yeah, there's somebody here that, that needs to just accept that and uh, move forward, pretty much, I feel move forward right here we have the chariot cancer of significance yeah guys um i feel like there's a person here that could be um for many of you this could be the feminine energy but there's an individual here that looks like they are ready to i don't feel like this person's waiting for anyone guys you see this person's about to jump this person's about to jump which to me is representative, right, of, and then right now I'm here, you better catch her before she jumps. That is pretty much the outcome, right? It seems as though there's um, an unexpected visitor here for many of you, perhaps, right? There's someone there in the back. Yeah, guys, that is what we have here. Let me pull a couple of cards just to close it up. That is what you can expect. Hmm, there's a... There's a lot going on there, but not a, a whole lot happening necessarily, right? All right, here we go. Communicate through writing. My goodness, this card has been popular. I just did uh, Sagittarius. I did Leo, and I believe both of them got this card. So communication, certainly receiving some sort of news, and then... And then here it says old news is there could be someone that's bald, <laughs> right? Or, you know, this old, this old news is just representative of an old energy. And it says time flies, time sensitive as well, guys. And yeah, I feel like receiving news, uh, old news, perhaps something, uh, 
receiving receiving news guys from many of you from an old energy I feel like time could be of significance here meaning right that uh, for some of you time could have passed a whole lot of time could have passed sorry Taurus my camera turned off I've been with you guys for 30 minutes Wow I did not expect that but it's okay I love you Taurus so so much and I don't mind spending all of this time on you okay so yeah time flies and old news so maybe this is a person that likes wearing watches okay time is of significance here guys in some way or, or another receiving communication that is uh, something and then I'm hearing but you know this this is ground mail guys okay this is ground mail mm. don't expect it to come tomorrow let's see Taurus, let's get an oracle card for you to close the reading. Let's get it from here. If you want to book a reading with me, guys, you can do so by going to the link down below in the description box. It's going to take you to VoyageTarot.com where you could book a private reading with me. If you have an Instagram, please do follow me on there. That link is down below. Let's see. This one right here, Taurus. Unikite. I believe that's how you pronounce it and it says answered prayers all your great work has opened the door for divine solutions and support all your great work has opened the door for divine solutions and support for many of you I feel like you're that uh, you're that woman whether you're a male or a female okay you're that that woman that person we saw at the very edge of that uh, building and that was the world card guys which means that there's this completion of a cycle, you know, things finally f falling into place, seeing things differently. Heavy foresight here as well. Foresight, new plans, new endeavors. All your great work has opened the door for divine solutions and support. Let me get another card for you. Wow. A lot of your hard work is finally paying off, my dear Taurus. And we do work hard, don't we? We sure do. I love that. All your great work has opened the door for divine solutions and support. So I feel like for many of you at this time, you could be um, needing perhaps some sort of assistance. You find yourself maybe in a situation. I'm hearing in the middle of some sort of plan, goal, something that you are working on that you need help with okay i feel like the universe is certainly certainly knows that and it's going to be stepping in and supporting you i'm hearing every step of the way don't you worry wow what a word rhodocrosite rhodocrosite i think be gentle with yourself you've been through a lot and need time to heal and recover wow be gentle with yourself. You've been through a lot and need time to heal and recover. So yeah, I feel like this is all about not being so hard on yourself, my dear Taurus. And that's another thing. We could certainly be, we have very high expectations and we certainly hold ourselves to those uh, very high expectations, don't we? And uh, we beat ourselves up when something doesn't really turn out the way that we want it to. I feel like that is touching on this. I mean, don't worry. The universe is going to uh, step in and help you, give you support. And you've done everything it is that you could have done. Things are going to work out, my dear. Be gentle with yourself. This is what I have for you, Taurus. Thank you so much for allowing me to do this reading for you. As always, truly, it was an honor and my pleasure. You guys take care, okay? Bye-bye.